Hey everybody, and welcome back to the Second Reality Project Reloaded, or Super Mario World uh, ROM hack. And today we are continuing things by doing the stage uh, Koopa Kick. Yes, Koopa Kick. Uh, this is going to be interesting because I'm not wearing my glasses at all, and from what I can tell, um, the guy tried kicking a shell at me. Dick. I don't know why, but this music just sounds really silly. Just listen to it. I'm gonna die soon. This guy is dead. And there is a going to be a multicolored shell. And he died pretty. Sounds like it could be like a children's, uh... An, intro, uh, an introduction to like a children's show. That's what it sounds like. And that was, that was pretty cool. Alright, let's... Oh my god. Why do you keep doing the same thing? Oh my god. Holy shit. There are too many Koopas here. I gotta get rid of them all. And I keep getting hit by every one of them. Do, 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 do. And I can't really add in... Oh my god, he like... That would have been amazing if he did... Oh, oh my god. Nuts. I mean, I really can't come up with like any meaningful lyrics to this uh, little song that we have going on here. But, you know, there's, there's something deep inside that tells me you don't want to hear that. Oh, you are... you are tricky. You guys are tricky, you know that? Oh, you little... Oh, you son of a gun, you. You're gonna die for that one. Oh, you're... you... You... I learned from my mistakes. That could have been, uh, set at such a better time, I guess. Yeah, this is gonna be one of those stages where they really get cheap on you. <laughs> you see what I mean? Let's see, is there another guy that's gonna kick something at me? No? I swear, I'm starting to get like a little paranoid here. As I fall straight- Yeah, there's some... Um, some more classic douchebag maneuvers. Sadly, I've like lost a whole shitload of mushrooms in the process. Okay, the gimmick is getting a little old at this point. Can we like, do something new? No, I guess not. It's just a one-trick pony, this stage. Is that the right saying? One-trick pony? You know, it's like... How do you... It's like, God knows I've never had to use that saying before in my life, so... Oh, and we got the fishies. We got the fishies. Get the hell... I'm sorry, I can't find a proper time to jump with these freaking things spamming the screen. Oh, and they come back. That's great. And you're back, too. Ah, uh, forget it. We are completed. Or we completed this stage. What time is it? It's like 2, two in the morning. Uh, I shouldn't say that, but it, it, it is. And we got a castle. Volcano castle. Oh god, not not the saws. Can I yeah I can jump on them. That's that's a relief. Alright, uh Oh my god, I timed that just right, which is highly unusual. And that wasn't too bad. That was a close one, but you know, it's not that I, I'm not used, you know, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Just losing my thought here. Losing my head also. Oh, shit. Yeah, now it gets its revenge. Ah, I still saw you coming, so don't worry. Alright, let's, uh, alright, just stay there, jeez. Okay, we got a throp here. So I guess in uh, 
kind of interesting news. Um, you know, I guess Nintendo is making good on their... I don't know, their promises to annoy Let's Players and stuff. Because in my last Kaizo video, which ha just happened to have the cutscenes from the, uh, the ending, and it, so they claimed a visual copyright BS like that. I mean, you know, I guess Nintendo really loses out on millions of dollars because people were able to see the ending credits to a game that's about 20 years old. I mean, am I right, people? It's, it's a bunch of bullshit if you ask me. So I had to delete that one and, um, because I'm not really taking chances. And, um, I had to cut out the cutscene and just re-upload it with pretty much no th nothing flashy, really. It's, it's just a fight with Bowser and that was pretty much it, which is kind of disappointing because, you know, I wanted to make that video, you know, much more because it's the last one in the series, but, you know, because they don't like losing millions of dollars because of, um, people seeing cutscenes to really outdated games, um, you know, I had to improvise. Because I still wanted there to be an ending to the series, I mean, you can't just cut out the last boss fight of the heck. That'd just be stupid. But it was kind of ridiculous running into that. Now I kind of have like this... I have this weird little paranoia about like checking the video upload section. This guy knows, I, I never know whether there's going to be a copyright um, claim or anything like that. And why do I die to these guys? Why do I die to you? It's like, you know, I never know, okay, who the hell else is going to claim content and all this shit against me this time. I mean, I already like the Honeymooners challenge from uh, Final Fantasy 1. I had to take that down because one by one the uh, videos were getting claimed and it was all because of like, what, the battle music from the random encounters that you get into? There were just sections of it that was uh, being claimed. It's like, fuck. Fuck! It's just like, it was kind of ridiculous, really. Fuck it, you know what, I'm running for it. There we go, it worked out. It was ridiculous. Uh, the, the freaking random battle music. Why did you do that? But, yeah, random battle music was what got me screwed over. And so, you know, I just got sick of getting all those messages, so I just figured, hell with it, I'll just I'll take it down and bullshit like that. And, I don't know, I've been pretty lucky so far on everything else, which is nice. And we are back to this point. I mean, it's really hard to do a little hobby like this and enjoy it when you have all that stuff to, um, really annoying you, really. I mean, this is, I don't know, I think this is pretty harmless, just playing like a ROM hack of, uh, you know, a game that I grew up playing. Cause God knows the original one was pretty damn easy. And God knows I played it enough times. So, you know, being able to play all these ROM hacks and stuff is very nice. And really, it's not like, it's not the ROM hack itself that's being, um, you know, claimed, to get, claimed on. It's just like the stupid little cutscenes of yo um what the little roll call with the enemies from the game and um some of the other cutscenes there too it's like i don't know it just makes me wonder why the hell would you even bother I mean, what the hell's the point i mean i love nintendo more than you know other people out there Especially since Nintendo's doing pretty shitty right now. 
continues it. And I died to the same guy, really, now. So, I get, you know, I, I grew up with Nintendo, and I love a lot of what they've done throughout the years. And, you know, they're doing pretty shitty right now, and I'm going to die. Is this the case? No, I lived. That is amazing. But, I don't see how... Going after a bunch of people who are just playing their games and, well, making recordings of it also, is going to hurt them any more than they've already hurt themselves. I mean... Shit! I survived that one too, which is the... Uh, Little ball buster there. I just... Oh! Oh, thank god. It's like, you know, I just... I don't know, just let a person play a game and record it for god's sakes. God knows they're gonna f screw the consumer over anyways with the new platformers. Or, uh, not platformers, but co consoles. Cause I'm pretty sure they have some dirty tricks up their sleeves. Now I sound like some like crazy conspiracist. Oh, why you were right there? Oh, whatever. Whatever. We're running for it, man. Oh, we were running for it. It's just I don't feel like waiting. Oh, the waiting. Oh my god. Well, let's save here. Oh shit, oh my god, that was just in the nick of time. What, are you, are you serious? This is it? Come on, I had the, the princess fight was a lot worse than this. But then again, that was Kaizo. Kaizo 3. With a vengeance. And I didn't save at the appropriate time, but I do have advanced knowledge of where this guy's going to... Really now? Oh my god! Spare me the bullshit. I don't want any of it. Oh, you you are a sneaky one. You come back here. Douche. Oh! And you are dead. Yes, yes. Winning. The only thing I can ask myself now is, what the hell was I talking about before? Anyways, we are being thanked by this egg here as we bash this castle to the ground. Mario has triumphed over Lemmy Koopa, who built his castle inside the volcano for... Who the hell knows why? From here, Mario moves on to the Ice Bomb Bridge, which will lead to the Symphonic Mountains. The Ice Bomb Bridge, that sounds... Great, bomb and bridge just go very well together. They just go so well together, oh my god. Anyways, I'll see you in the next episode to find out what's beyond this pipe. Even though we kind of do know what's beyond this pipe. But anyways, sayonara people.